get hit from his cousin took it in the family. Is it Jordan? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. You too. You too. Thank you. Thank you. All right, you guys. We have made it to Best Buy. It's like right in front of me. I'm about to run in here real quick and pick up baby's gift. I'm so excited. Like, I'm so excited to give her a gift, y'all. She has been wanting to do her content creating. And I just think that's beautiful because I do content on Instagram and now here on YouTube and on TikTok. So I think it's pretty dope that she wants to follow in my footsteps. <laughs> nah, but for real though, y'all, like, I love that about her. Like, if y'all not already tuned into her on TikTok, her name is tipsy with tay and she does drinks in a quick trip cup and y'all the commentary is great like my baby is fucking hilarious like she is just like her commentary makes the drinks and the drinks are super good and so the thing is she gets me to drink them after she's done making them and y'all it'll be so fire like on the first try so if y'all not tuned in yet i'm gonna leave that down in the description box please follow her you guys on tiktok and also follow our couples channel too you guys because we're gonna start pushing out content on our channel again as well but yeah y'all i'm about to run in here and get my baby stuff because she needs her stuff like she just needs her stuff like I can't wait for her to open it and just like oh love on it and stuff like that and ever since I got my MacBook she been kind of jealous so I was like I'm gonna do a little one two for my baby and stuff and see how she like it it's hitting y'all I have to turn y'all over here because the sun is like oh the sun is hitting mmm yes <laughs> no but y'all for real though it's literally right there All right, y'all. Hi. You need my coat, like QR coat. Yeah, iPad. Mhm. Mm Thank you. You too. All right, you guys. So I got the iPad. I'm not gonna lie. The interaction in there was very freaking awkward. Like the lady was kind of rude. So I really couldn't like talk for real. I feel like some people's customer service is just like not the best and that kind of like rubbed me the wrong way but anyway we have the goods so that's all that matters i'm sorry that there's like a lots of glares happening the sun is literally coming in from this direction so but y'all we about to grab real quick while i'm still here and then i'm gonna run to the grocery store but y'all we got the goods we got the goods i'm super excited for her to open it y'all i don't even have a bag for her to put this in like i don't know what i'm going to do but i don't have a bag for her to put it in so i don't know y'all we might just be wrapping this up because i don't know what to put it in you know i gotta take my pictures and stuff for snapchat that i can post later i'm about to grab real quick and eat my chick-fil-a which I just saw me go grab. Before I really grab and stuff like that, y'all, y'all let me know down below if y'all want to get to know me because I would definitely love to, like, answer y'all questions. If y'all want to, I can really answer them now real quick while I'm grabbing and stuff like that because I have a few questions already, like, on my Instagram from you guys, like, asking me questions about me and stuff like that. So if y'all want to do that, we can do that real quick, too because i have it screenshotted i'm gonna just answer a few y'all before i run into this store the first question is did you do youtube just for the money or because you really want to do youtube obviously i did youtube because i really want to do youtube like i'm a small like content creator slash influencer whatever you want to call me and i think that it gets misconstrued that like we do stuff like put out content and stuff like that for you guys to make money but that's really not the case like i've been doing nails for five years now and along the way i've been promoting my work on social media mainly on instagram that's like my biggest platform social media wise personal and my business instagram but along the way i've been posting my stuff on both my personal and my nail instagram page so I already was like doing it and like doing my videos and stuff like that and the nails thing like 
I usually just like take videos of my clients nails like after I'm done and the people was like oh you should start doing like a day in the life like showing like your clients coming in maybe you even talking to your clients what you're doing to their nails and then like the end result and I'm like okay cool that'll be fun but aside from doing nails like I try not to get burnt out of doing nails because it started off as a hobby like I tried it I loved it I liked it and then people was like oh you should start actually doing nails like doing it for real and stuff that and charging people for it so I'm like okay cool this is I can do this and then I went to nail school and graduated took my state boards got a license and all that and then I opened up my own business but because I didn't want to get burnt out of it I started doing personal stuff on my personal Instagram where I would do reels of me cooking my dinner and like me coming home from work and clean up my apartment afterwards or like I would do like recipes and stuff like that and my workout videos like those went crazy on social media like crazy and then I said well I do like day in the life and stuff and people start liking it so to answer the question no I did not do YouTube to get money because you start from the bottom like this is the very bottom like I think I have 119 subscribers right now currently and do y'all know how long it takes to like get big in YouTube? with YouTube? Like it takes a long time to get huge doing YouTube. So, you know, I definitely, it wasn't just about the money. Like I love to talk to the camera. I love to talk to y'all and engage with people, people from wherever. I'm just that type of person. Like I want to chit chat and talk and get to know you and let y'all see a day in the life of me because that's the type of stuff that I look at. So no, to answer the question, it wasn't for the money. It was because I genuinely like doing it. I like being in front of the camera and yeah, like I just like to put out this type of stuff. Okay. So the second question is how did you lose so much weight? okay yeah so i lost a bunch of weight like a bunch of weight back in 20 i want to say it was 22 i started at the end of 21 and then like ended up going into 22 and honestly you guys like i did keto for four months straight and then i went to like uh, maybe like 75 to 100 grams of carbs so when i was doing keto i was strict i was doing like 15 to 20 grams of carbs a day max like that's what I was doing and working out and stuff like that and I did a bunch of strength training so literally it was just like a combination of me doing keto working out literally like I was working out like maybe four times a week four to five times a week and I was going really 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 heavy like I was lifting heavy as hell y'all and I just didn't stop like that's literally how I lost weight drink a bunch of water I was drinking like a gallon of water a day I remember Taylor used to get mad at me y'all because like I wouldn't cook the same like I stopped cooking with like lots of carbs and stuff like that and just like really up my protein so that's how I lost a bunch of weight and if y'all want a video on that too like my workout regimen you guys my camera just cut off because the temperature got really hot from the sun shining but if you guys want a video on that like we can definitely do that like i'm talking like my workouts and like i said recipes and all the things that i actually did and i have all that in my notes i can definitely do that show you guys videos like my workout routine literally from start to finish all that i do not mind putting that out there so if y'all interested let me know and i lost about 55 pounds in four months doing keto straight and doing a bunch of cardio and then when I switched to my strength training I lost the remaining so I did lose 80 pounds total but if y'all want a video on it I can do that for y'all okay you guys I'm gonna answer one more question because my camera is getting high and I do really have to go to the grocery store for real y'all um I'm gonna answer this question because I think this is interesting if you actually blow up what would you do with your money or success y'all I would bless the people around me like give back to the people who supported me like I never had handouts or anything like I did all this shit by myself but I would give out I would give back to those people because like I feel like sometimes you need support and sometimes you need people who can ground you and keep you you just need people in your life to like ground you and be there for you and stuff like that and that's not a bad thing like people always say like oh I don't want nobody like to help me like I don't know I did this by myself and I started from the bottom and blah, blah, blah. that's fine now like I did too literally but like the people who like always watch my videos always like Jordan like this was great or give me feedback even people right now who are like 
asking me questions right now about me and why I'm doing what I'm doing, I want to give back to those people. So I wouldn't splurge a lot of money. Like, I'm not sure how the money even gets put out like on youtube and stuff like that but i would definitely stay centered and stay who i am and get back to the people who supported me so yeah that's the answer to that question but yeah with that being said we about to run to the grocery store and stuff like that so i will hop on here once i get home all right you guys as you can tell i just made it home it is currently 7 5 p.m y'all i need to get started on dinner back up all of baby's presents for valentine's day set up the kitchen all that i put the wine in the fridge and stuff like that but y'all i have to get to cooking and all of that stuff so let's do that and then once i'm done i will show you guys the final look all right you guys i'm done with dinner i'm about to call baby out right now we're about to enjoy dinner and stuff like that y'all i will see you guys in the next video just continue to watch the rest of this video enjoy the scenery and all of that and i hope you guys enjoyed it happy valentine's day to all of you out there i love love y'all and i hope you guys are having a good night i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in the next video good night I'm like so in love. Happy Valentine's Day out there to you guys. Mm -hmm.